नमस्ते एवरीवन वीट रवा उपमा इज अ वेरी हेल्दी ब्रेकफास्ट ऑप्शन एंड कैन बी प्रिपेयर्ड इंस्टेंटली एंड पीस करी अलोंग विथ इट मेक्स द ब्रेकफास्ट प्रोटीन रिच टू मेक दिस उपमा आई एम यूजिंग दिस स्मॉल टाइप ऑफ वीट रवा और ब्रॉकन वीट और दलिया द स्मॉलर टाइप आई एम यूजिंग हियर आई हैव टेकन वन कप ऑफ वीट रवा टू स्टार्ट विद द रेसिपी heat a pan add oil mustard seeds urad dal red chili split into two green chilies and ginger finely chopped and a few curry leaves add 3 cups of water and require salt wait for the water to boil when water starts boiling add wheat rava after this keep the flame low and then close and cook after for about 3 4 minutes check whether the rava has cooked If it is not cooked you can sprinkle some water and cook again But here see the rava has become soft that means it is cooked Add some freshly grated coconut This is optional but this gives good taste for the upma You can add even more freshly grated coconut if you like the taste of coconut Our wheat rava upma is ready. Close and keep this for a few more minutes before serving. To make peas curry, we can use either white or green color peas. These peas have soaked for about eight hours. Add required salt, chopped green chilies, and water, and pressure cook this for about four to five minutes. After releasing the pressure we can see the white peas has become soft and cooked well heat oil in a pan add mustard seeds red chilies green chilies and ginger finely chopped a few curry leaves and add in the cooked white peas mix and allow it to boil well add turmeric powder and red chili powder red chili powder you can avoid if you don't want to make the curry much spicy add grated coconut and check the salt if you want you can add some more salt and finally add some hing or asafoetida This gives good flavor for the peas curry. Our white peas curry is ready to be served. Wheat rava upma and peas curry is a good combination. Do try out this recipe and subscribe to Paisom Talks. Thank you.